Yeah, I'm, uh, but I, I was always a big fan of Spider-Man 2099. Uh, back in the day when yeah. Peter David was writing it yep. and, and Rick Leonardi was doing yeah, the art. I, do. Rav Ravager was garbage. Yeah, yeah, that was that was garbage. I hated. I didn't I, like the X Men. I didn't like the X Men one either. I didn't mind the Punisher. Yeah, Punisher was great. Um, the Hulk I didn't like. Nope. I forget what other twenty nine. Did they have a Doom was awesome. Doom was awesome. Yeah. Doom was awesome. They did the Ghost Rider twenty ninety nine. Yeah, Ghost Rider was yeah good. I could take it or leave it. You know. Yeah. yeah, it was it was it was decent, but it was hell. After reading the Hulk and the X Men and whatnot. Yeah. Ghost Rider was a work of literature, yo. Know? <laughs> and I liked when he was in, when Spider-Man 2009 was in our universe for a little while there in the Spider-Man yeah. books. But when he went when he went back over into his universe, the last time around, I didn't like it anymore. I, I actually- Yeah, it was only a couple years ago, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Did you watch the Batman yet? <sighs> You, you're gonna have to plan have like four days. I have to force. Out. I have to force myself to watch that crap. You know, it's. Uh, it's good. Uh, I mean, it's Batman, though. You know, it's. Uh, I mean, there's never been a good, except for Heath Ledger Batman. There's never been a good Batman. I mean, like, you watch it and you enjoyed it the first time you watch it. Like, wow, man, that was that was pretty good. But you go watch it a second time, and you realize this movie's not good. Oh, I mean, I literally have to like, I'd have to plan out an evening. It's so long. And you know how I feel about three-hour-long movies. They, they suck. Yeah. All right. They, they're they're like no nine, good. Ninety minutes is like your sweet spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you start at the two-hour mark, that's where it's it's about it's about time to go. Yeah. Um, but Batman has always just been. Every one of their movies has always been kind of just slow and plotting. Um, I can't picture that for three hours. Ninety-nine percent of any movie that's three hours, even a guy who doesn't know anything about movie making, and I'm that guy. Um, <laughs> Could cut shit out of a movie, okay? It's 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 just too long. I have to trick myself into wanting to watch yeah. it, or it's it's, it's going to take too much energy to actually build myself to have to sit and watch that yeah. movie. It's free on HBO, so right. I mean, uh, I'll end up watching it sometime when I I don't. Um, I just I don't know when I don't care. Let's let's just let three hours of my life disappear today. Right. Yeah, right, 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 right. Maybe I'll be doing shit while it's on. Yeah, Maybe, you know, playing on my phone or. Reading a comic, but I'll watch it again. But again, I I, I have the Spider-Man movie at home, the new one. Loved it. I, I, I loved, loved it too. I saw it in yeah. the theaters, and yeah. I loved it. And I just two and a half hours. That flew by. The Batman movie oh, yeah. is three hours, yeah. and there's parts where I'm like, it drags. I didn't feel when I was watching that. I did not feel that it was two and a half hours. Spider-Man. Spider-Man. No. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. No. That was well written, tight. You yep. know, it's uh, um, yeah. I really I enjoyed that movie a lot. Are you gonna go see Doctor Strange? No, no. But it's it's like two hours and four minutes. It's at the perfect time. Right. But it's Sam Raimi. It's Sam Raimi. <laughs> That's right, right. And then and I can't I can't bring myself can't bring myself to go get fooled by a Sam Raimi movie again. I like this Evil Dead and stuff. But most of Sam Raimi shit, garbage. Um, well, the first three Spider-Man movies I can't even watch. Drag me to hell. I never watched Drag Me to Hell. Oh, that's a great movie. I felt I was already in hell when I was watching the Spider-Man no, movies. No, no, no. Drag Me so, to Hell, you gotta watch that movie. I did like it. It's just too long. I, no, no. I, 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 I'm trying to psych myself up to, to, to spend the three hours to actually watch it. You no, know? I it's, saw it in the theater, and like I left. I, I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed the Riddler. I really enjoyed his Batman. There was just, like, when I left, I was like, there were so many scenes that could have been cut out, like, just... Catwoman driving on a motorcycle, Batman driving on a motorcycle, Batman brooding on top of a building. Like, it looks for pretty. 15 minutes. Right, like, right. Just cut it out and get me out of here in two, two and a half hours would have been perfect. Three hours and five minutes is like, I, I had to pee once in the middle because God forbid, <laughs> God forbid I have a soda at the movie theaters and like, you know, but no, it was good. I, I actually liked it. I really liked um, Colin Farrell as the penguin. I thought he was awesome. I can't wait till his show comes out on HBO. Um, he, Robert Pattinson was awesome. Um, the Riddler was awesome. Even the Joker was awesome. Yeah. Right. We were talking last time I was in here last week, that opening 20 minutes when they have the bat signal and it's like four different crimes going on and they all look up and they see it and they all start freaking out and then you hear footsteps and they keep flashing to each four cr like for criminal element and like, you know, a bunch of them like say fuck this and like run away and stuff and you just keep hearing footsteps and then he comes out of the dark and they start laughing at him. And they're like, what are you supposed to be? And then he beats the shit out of like eight guys, like hardcore beats the shit out of him. I'm like, okay, this is good. But then it just like, 
there were just so many just extra just crap in there that I was like, just cut it out. It was like this close to being rated R. <laughs> like there were a couple scenes where I'm like, oh, he must have like, like, all right, like we have to cut out this part of like the guy with blood all around him and shit like that. But yeah. no, I think you like it. It's just really yeah. long. Yeah. With, with a track record of all the other, of all the other Batman movies where um, it just, I have to prepare myself just to want to watch it. You know, it's, uh, right. um, you know, do, do, do I just want to go for plotting three hour movie tonight? Um, it's the only thing I'm watching tonight now. Right. Yeah, yeah right. you know, right. it's, right. Uh, it. right, right. And you might, it might be continued tomorrow morning. Yeah, right, right. Yeah, because I'm going to watch it with my wife. Right. Which one falls asleep? Yeah, it's uh, most that, likely her. I'm, but I'm, what I plan on watching this weekend is going to be Willy's Wonderland. Is that the Nicolas Cage? Yeah. Uh, goes crazy in the showbiz pizza. Yeah, yeah. Get, all yeah. the animatronics get are sa like the infected by yeah, yeah, Satan yeah, or yeah. something. Yeah. That Where, just looks like a f what is that on? Hulu. Uh, I don't. Have, that's like the one thing I don't have. Yeah. I finished Moon Knight last night. Yeah. Oh, I mean, I, yeah. We have to. I have to watch the last. I haven't watched the last one Did, yet. How, what do you think? It's okay. It's it's all right. I like it. I don't love it, but yeah. but I've but I'm okay watching it. Like you know, I usually watch it. We don't usually watch it Wednesday night when it comes, but we'll watch it usually Thursday night. Same, um, same. But and right, I, I watched it last night because yeah. I was like, I I don't know what's gonna happen, but I don't want to be spoiled. I'm yeah. like, if we're, if Werewolf by Night comes out or something, I'm like, I want to see a Werewolf. Yeah. <laughs> It's 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 good enough that I actually watch it within the first couple of days that, yeah. it, that it comes out. Uh, you know, I don't. It doesn't linger to the week a week later. Um, so yeah, it's good. There's parts of it that I love, and there's other parts that I'm just like, yeah, I could I could do, I could do without it. But yeah. I mean, it's an only it's only an hour. It's only an hour long or less than an hour like show. 48 right. Minutes. I mean, yeah. yeah. I mean, there's there's enough that goes on into it All to right. keep you that, that keeps you that keeps you liking it. You know, it's. Yeah. Uh, like if they don't have, if there's not a second season, if there's not a second season of WandaVision, don't care. If there's not a second season of Loki, don't care. Um, oh, there is. They yeah. already, they already, they're already oh. doing uh, Loki. Okay, but I'm okay season. with it. I'll watch it. Yeah. But I don't, but I don't care if it never comes back yeah. out again. This, I actually want to see some more. You know. Same with Falcon and the Winter Soldier. See, I love that one. That was... I liked it, but that was the one that out of all of them, uh, yeah. Maybe WandaVision was probably my least favorite. WandaVision is my least favorite. And then, and then I liked, I really liked Loki, and then I, I liked Moon Knight too. But none of them are like fantastic. Yeah, like right. they're, they're, they're good. good. Right, they're good. But I would love, I love buddy films. A Falcon and Winter Soldier is your perfect buddy film. Yeah. I'll watch. They can make a million of them. I'll watch them. I mean, I'm, you know, I'm a, you know, lethal weapon type of guy. Those type, you know, those type of things, um, where they, where the the two main characters need to really actually go to a therapist. You, you know, right, it's right, uh, right, right. oh, Hawkeye, that, Hawkeye. Yeah. I forgot. Hawkeye was probably my favorite. Yeah, that, that, was, that was, it was, it was just so much fun with yeah. with both of them. You know, it's yeah, it, that was she, a good. The, um, Haley, whatever her last name is, was awesome. Yeah, I think so. Kate Bishop. She yeah. was fantastic. And you know who took it is for such a minor character was the other Black Widow, uh, Yelena. Oh, I love her. Yeah, she, she was, was awesome. great. She was yeah. just so sarcastic, yeah. and I cracked up all all, the, all the time. One, like she's eating like the ramen or whatever, yeah. and the, <laughs> she's just making fun of her. And... Yeah. And again, I liked her in the Black Widow movie too. I do. Yeah. Yeah. I actually really liked the Black Widow movie. I did too. I did too. Yeah, so it's um, I'm 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 okay I'm okay with all of it except again like I said just trouble with Batman, just trouble trouble having to watch Batman, but we'll watch it, we'll see it and we'll we'll go with that. But this is Willy's Wonderland this weekend I think. Yeah, I I, I... so that new Nicolas Cage movie came out, the one where he's playing himself. I want to see that. That looks like a lot of fun. I fucking love Nicolas Cage, yeah. but they they had an article and I read it and it was like the top ten craziest Nicolas Cage movies. That you have to watch, mm -hmm. and that was one of them. Yeah. Um, Mandy was one, which was awesome. Have you seen that I one yet? That one. Oh, that's good. That's fucking bonkers. Yeah. Uh, the color of light, or the color of sound. Well, all this, all this newer stuff now, just seems like, hey, look. I've done everything that needs to be done. I just want to do some stupid shit, yo, and just have fun doing. Yeah, I want to just like scream and like overact and yeah. be like a nut. Yeah. And he does a great job at doing it oh, too. Oh, he's fantastic. Yeah, because he's been, he's, Nicolas Cage has made some stinkers. Where it's like, I can't, yeah, I mean, you're like, I can't believe I just wasted the 25 minutes before I turned this off to watch this sort of thing, you know? I mean, it's, if you go back and watch Con Air, 
It's a pretty shitty movie. It's awesome. I watched it the other night. But it's a, it's not a great movie, but it's awesome. Con Air and The Rock. The Rock is actually yeah, a good movie. Yeah, I love The Rock. I, I love that movie. But, like, if you watch some of his shit, it's not great. Bad Lieutenant, Port of Call, New Orleans. I remember watching that, like, a while ago, and I was not impressed. But somebody said, like, no, you got to go back and watch it. He's amazing in it. What was it? What was it, like, a sequel to The Bad Lieutenant? Like it was not a sequel. It's not a sequel. Almost, like, the same thing. Just in a different city, yeah. and it's Nicolas Cage. That's probably, why, that's probably why I didn't see it, because The Bad Lieutenant, after watching it once, that was enough. Like, the, yeah, origi yeah. the original yeah. Bad Lieutenant, you know? It's, uh, it's like, like, what was it? Uh, Henry Portrait of Serial Killer. Like, yeah, I saw it. Yeah. I'm, don't that's, need, don't yeah, need don't to see it again, it. right. Don't right, so, so I never watched that, you know, when the, the other one, the, the other Bad Lieutenant. I see Bad Lieutenant, I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he doesn't have a scene where he's jerking off on the side of a car with yeah. like the girls inside of it so i, I can't remember but yeah. i first, remember that from the first one too yeah, yeah. I, yeah. Think, I think anybody that sees it that's the scene that kind of stands out i think i've seen more full frontal nudity from harvey keitel than any <laughs> than any other actor besides a porn actor in uh you know in in, in the world right. <laughs> yeah, that guy has no problem no no not at all yeah no I, yeah watch the batman you just have to convince your wife maybe get some Caffeine in you. It's not an afternoon show that we're gonna watch. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be after, you know, after work, after dinner, you know, right. sort of thing. So, you know, you're talking starting to watch about eight o'clock to begin with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eleven yeah. thirty. Right, right, right. She's and by eleven, by I mean she's in bed by ten o'clock every night yeah. for, to get up early in the morning to work. Um, it's a day off, but by eleven she's already starting to, yeah. you know, it's it's past her bedtime. Yeah, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Now, now I don't know if you're. If you're interested in seeing it too, but like, man, that Top Gun 2 looks fantastic. I will watch Top Gun anything, okay? I, okay, I'll give it a all right. chance, all right? That was like right in my, that was like fifth or sixth grade when the first one came out. And it was like one of those ones that like defined like, like it was always on H like one of my friends at HBO, it was always on, like every day it was on. Yeah. Always, oh, I, I was like, can't wait to see it. And my wife was like, I hate Tom Cruise. I love Tom Cruise. I'm like, I'm not a fan, but I love I love all the Mission Impossible yeah. movies. I love Top Gun. I love War of the Worlds. I love, I'm like, oh, maybe I am a fan. Well, see, I never said I was a fan of Tom Cruise either. I said, no, I'm not a fan of Tom Cruise. But then I started naming his movies. I love that movie. I love yeah. that movie. I like, <laughs> so, so maybe I am a fan. Yeah, so that's... guess what? I am going to just admit, because it's not popular to admit yeah. that you're a fan of Tom Cruise. I'm coming out right now to say I am a fan of Tom Cruise. Will this... you get a shirt that says I am a fan of Tom Cruise? I've got no problem with a shirt that says I am a fan of Tom Cruise, okay? It's, I mean, I've done dumber things before. I've worn dumber things. As a matter of fact, if you look at one of the, um, one of the new This Week things, I'm wearing a pinkish, you know, color um, shirt or whatever. So if I'm wearing that, I can wear a... I can wear a, I can wear a uh, I'm a fan of Tom Cruise. Yeah, I'm a fan of Tom Cruise shirt. I'll have to yeah. find one. Big enough for me, though. I don't need, a, I don't need my... Uh, right, you don't yeah. need a half shirt? Yeah, I don't need, no one wants to see me in a half shirt of that, okay? Right. Yeah, but... um. Yeah, he's he's done so many movies that I've liked yeah. that you know that I never says, oh man, I, I want to go see a Tom Cruise movie, but they're always there's always something good yeah. in some in some of them. I mean, oh he's God, he's those, done some stinkers, but yeah, too. But those Mission Impossible movies, them. the first first three are meh, and then like the newer ones are amazing. I think some of the stuff he's done, he he got better with age. I agree. The Risky Business was great. I, I watched Risky Business as a teenager. A bazillion times, you know. Yeah. Um, and yeah, you know, when it was, it was always on HBO. Yeah, That's right. Another one that yeah. was always on HBO, and it had nudity. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He was on his. Hey, I am a hot, pretty boy right now. I'm popular, and he rested on those laurels for a while. Yeah. But then you realize, hey, I am not that young, pretty boy anymore. I've grown up a yeah. little, and he just changed and did different things. And yeah, I'm I'm a fan. I'll watch Top Gun 2. I won't go to the movies to see it, but I'll watch it. Oh, you won't? No, no, no. There's very few, again, there's very few movies that, that I'll actually say, I'm gonna go to the movies to see that. I'll probably be at Jurassic Park. That's another way, because it has everybody. That's the only That's the only movie, I mean, that's my favorite franchise is Jurassic Park. Out of all the franchises, that's my favorite franchise. And I think that's one of the, the only ones that I could say that I've gone to every movie that's come out at the theater to see, yeah. yeah. As a matter of fact, the last two, I actually saw on opening week. Now I don't go to opening week of anything. Usually it's, they're, they're about to leave the theater and that's when I go to see them when there's six people in it. Yeah, the last two I've gone on opening week. One, please. There you go. 
Thank you. Thank you. I always try to go early because I get afraid of like somebody's gonna say something. Yeah, I don't care. Ah, see, I, I like to be surprised. Yeah. What is it they're not gonna surprise oh, you with? Yeah, you know, Park right? I mean, I mean, I'm gonna if if you again if you say who Kaiser Soze is, there's you lost a surprise. Right. You blew it. Most of the other things. Okay, you told me the ending. It wasn't, a, most of the time I figured out the ending halfway right, through, right. halfway through, anyways. Now, okay, I know how it ends. As long as it's not a twist ending like Kaiser Soze, right. um, you know, you have you have that ending. Yeah, but uh, there was a story in, that got me to the ending. Somebody came in and said, Tom Cruise is playing Wolverine in Doctor Strange. Would that get you to go to the theater? No. 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 <laughs> no. He's the right size. He's oh, like yeah. Five, yeah, yeah, no, no, it's still, it's still Sam Raimi and I'm not taking, I've, he fooled me, he fooled me Three times, okay. It's uh, I went to th I went to three movies of, of Spider Man with him. Oh, second Spider Man, yeah. so good. It was good when you first watch it once. Try rewatch it again. If Doc Doc isn't on the screen, who wants to watch it? You know, well, it's, that, that's what it is. It's yeah. the villain, right? I mean, I, I feel like that's the same with the uh, Dark Knight too. Yeah, right. No, that wasn't a Batman movie. That was a Joker yeah. movie, right? Yeah. And when Joker and when Joker wasn't on the f on the screen, who wanted to watch any more of the film? You ruined you ruined Two Face in there. I think Harvey Dent was just a throwaway character, and he's a great character. Um, Harvey didn't do didn't really didn't do anything. You know, it was it was it was Joker. It was, he he was like a means to an end to make yeah. Batman the bad guy. Right. That's that all it was. was. That movie should have been the Joker. Batman was the supporting character yeah. in that film. But again, now you rewatch it, all you want to watch is a Joker. Just just edit out all those scenes and watch Joker scenes and turn and and move on. Right. I, I agree. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. I gotta go. I, I'm not gonna. I'll do that. I'm gonna start. To, I'll. I'll do that next week. Okay. Before. Sorry about that. No. No worries.